Welcome one and all to The Basement, where we make a big song and dance about original music one Sunday every month. You can find details of future streams on the Lee's Musical Adventures website, Facebook and Instagram. Please remember to follow us and hit subscribe to the channel you are currently viewing. Today we have a first for The Basement, as we are welcoming not one but two artists. First up, spoken word artist and social critic John Paul will be treating us to his clever wordplay over electronic beats. And following closely behind will be Nottinghamshire's Eric's London with their brand of energetic rock. I'll be getting the lowdown on their history and plans for the future in a bit, but for now, let's go live. teach you how to breathe I can teach you how to treat me I can teach you how to breathe I can teach you how to treat me the microclimate in your mind needs to sit down for the sake of time your worship has a birthday how does that work eh peaky blinded by the telly it's shit you think it's all about you that cap fits like it's supposed to Dislocated robots from the decade of the teens The freedom from regime is not some tagged up jeans Another two bot blue who's convinced he lives the dream The vision you're defending still remains to be seen Infantry on streets, conflicts they'll never be The end you fought the fed you and you still don't eat There's nothing left to offer, are you voting for confusion? You can't wake up to truth, it's still just an illusion Ooh, ooh, ah Ooh, ooh, ah I can teach you how to breathe I can teach you how to treat me I can teach you how to breathe I can teach you how to treat me Is it that unusual well, it still bamboozles you? A disorderly cue, it's what we're told to do Elderly ideals, they never stop descending Don't you ever reckon, it's all about pretending can't turn back the clock, now it's all online Pretend it never happened, it's all a waste of time Dislocated robots from the decade of the teens The freedom from regime is not some tagged up jeans Another two bob blue who's convinced he lives the dream The vision you're defending still remains to be seen I can teach you how to breathe I can teach you how to treat me I can teach you how to breathe I can teach you how to treat me Thank you, thank you Do you wanna go outside or just hit me now instead? Who put a quid on the dickhead? Do you wanna go outside or just hit me now instead? Bonfire's been pissed on by what went before What you based your life upon you bore Three games on the trot and the latest indie rock Spoon fed from the pages of the enemy Done up like a souped up Subaru It's always old when it's news to you Still you choose to blab like you do Past tense musical influence don't make no more sense does it? Are you sure it's all been done before? Been done before? Do you wanna go outside or just hit me now instead? Who put a quid in the dickhead? Do you wanna go outside or just hit me now instead? You still suffering the fools? 
Under the ridicule, under the impression that you still think you're cool Rubbing your chin, I'm out on a whim Who put a quid in the dickhead? Do you wanna go outside or just fit me now instead? I've gotta get out of this place, it ain't no life for me When humour transcends stupidity Doing something new with your one love tattoo And your burden cranny put to view The walking contradiction everybody knew Another pair of blue suede shoes Vape fags with Bluetooth, what's next? Virtual reality youth Programmed by programs of untruth Divided factions over your good reactions No one's coming for you Coming for you Coming for you Coming for you Do you wanna go outside or just fit me now instead? Who put a quid in the dickhead? Do you wanna go outside or just fit me now instead? Pounds, shillings and pence makes no sense no more In the currency of lunacy with fuck all else to show for it That's up to you You've not known me 20 years, it was only two Friendships done over monetary gain It's all that goes on in a two for one brain Time's dealt with the shit, I keep me beak out of it Gad times, glad times, give me some of it I don't crave no recognition, it's not what I'm after Just a bit of laughter will do, but not from you Irrelevant supergroups for that contact, the Stone Age on Jazz Fruit. That social site reveals what you really like, it's why you're out of sight. Reputation means no when you don't end up with O. Nothing. Who put a quid in the dickhead? Do you want to go outside or just hit me now instead? Who put a quid in the dickhead? Do you wanna go outside or just fit me now instead? Back to basic, some cunt sitting in the wing waiting to piss on my tiles. Out the pan and into the fire, the life of time to the bigoted liar. I'm not ending up like Bonnie and Clyde, no snide beetle or stone, no Israelite from a broken home. I didn't care about that wanker side, I just pushed it aside till you lifted up the anchor. Now I won't ever let it slide. Then I see what I want looking for inside, the only thing left to pursue. Now football ain't got a clue. Hey, I'm AMF, they just don't have nerd you The drinking den, the company of cool And someone breaks the rule and it's look at that fool So steer yourself through spider space Best place for a spoof head case Tapping buttons back places you've never been to Racers you've never spoke to Be careful what you wish for Get your head to the back of the queue Who put a quid in the dickhead? Do you want to go outside or just hit me now instead? Who put a quid in the dickhead? Do you want to go outside or just hit me now instead? Done. Taxed on what you don't realise you're buying Self-isolating from viruses for ages I'm bored of the vaudeville reference great ravers Get away from the numbers The insecure must have ripped to the gut With a desperation to self-destruct What you thought you'd seen is not what it seems The reality is a lot more obscene Probably not best to look past the screen Dream of an awakened rain stream Read it and fucking weep No education, it's all immigration, excitation Accept the mitigation, oblivious to the magnanimous We shall remain anonymous, immune to any sort of truth So blatantly fucking obvious to a populist decline Asking for a friend why engaging with cavemen online was good for the mind I mean in the end, where do you draw the line? You can't educate the afraid, dragging up crusades For God's sake, our lame Underlying 
Firstly, lovely love, neurotic fixation Borders on sociopathic frustration I hope to resolve the trauma that propaganda must have caused you Point to the doll, where did they touch you? All that overthinking to wind up in the clean Sober as a judge, don't blame it on the drink We've been here before, it's boring, don't you ever think? The fate of a failed upbringing would have been the final captain in a castle coffin if it weren't for the cat doffing. The greatest respect, I detest the brass neck of the rest. Deep down, don't realise they've all been used. Through it all, they'd rather see you lose. Probably should have concentrated more on you. It proved absolutely useless to break the cycle of abuse. 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 Too much corruption in this town Such a country 
Guys, welcome to the basement, and thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Thank for you. Thank you. Nice nice. So this is a first for us. We've only ever, well, we've never had two artists on the same day. So thank you for uh, bringing John Paul along. Um, yeah, that's thanks, been a treat for us. Thanks, thanks for that. Thanks 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 nice. yeah, We're looking forward to hearing more uh, more from you guys later. Um, but to first, I just want to ask you a bit about uh, about what you do. So obviously, you've uh, got this sort of funk hip hop groove thing going on with your backing tracks. How is it that you uh, you get those backing tracks together for your work? <laughs> Um, my mate does it, um, rap from Bristol, rap man. Um, yeah, he's a good guy. Yeah, we, he's into the same stuff as I am. I'm into the same stuff as he is. Right. So, okay. Yeah. And you write your words over. He sort of sends you the beats, and you write the words over that. Is that how you? Yeah. Sometimes, and then we do it differently each time. So. Oh, okay. Uh, right. So you've got a fairly organic um, kind of collaboration going on yeah so I mean from a from a lyrical perspective what is it that, uh, that sort of inspires you most to write um, I won't say it inspires me but just the state of the fucking place that we live in Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, the UK really isn't it yeah. yes that's it I was gonna say that's a, still very much part of that kind of punk ethos isn't yeah it? yeah I, 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 I sit in pubs a lot, <laughs> <laughs> listening to people. Listening yeah, to yeah. people, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I was going to yeah. say it's got very that sort of uh, that sort of very real street level vibe to to what you're doing. Um, but you've got a lot of that kind of hip hop groove in there as well, okay. as far as the the rhyming structures and that kind of thing. Okay, is that something you've done uh, done for a long time? It's not really something I I, I just do what I do. If you know what I mean. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm not probably overanalyzing yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, it's the first time I've heard you. You see, so you're immediately like, well. That's, what does this remind me of? What have I seen here? But uh, yeah, it's really, really, really good, really interesting stuff. Thank you, thank you. So thank you very much for coming. Well, thank you um, for having me. Yeah. That's what Eric. we brought him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. It's cool. yeah. So Eric's London. Um, yeah. Tell us a bit about yourself and your. Where did you guys come from? Ruben, <laughs> well, it's your turn. Yeah. Uh, well, Eric's is from Italy. Yeah, um, unfortunately. We, <laughs> we met on a band site, really. Oh, uh, me did, and Eric's yeah. met on the band site. We used to uh, we follow the Sleaford Muds. And um, she used to have ah, right, nice. bright pink hair, 
So a profile kind of stood out like I saw a film, you know. Um, <laughs> but in a good way, it turns yeah, out. Yeah, in a good way, yeah, yeah. So um, I uh, started chatting to you, didn't we? And then realised you got music here. in your band. Then I moved here. So I went to watch a play with her because she had an Italian band, uh, Italian musicians. And, oh, in um, London, yeah. Yeah, in yeah, and I come to see you play and I thought, you've got something really good here. Cool. And then we just got talking and everything talking and too much you, yeah talking too much <laughs> and, and then I moved here, over here. I moved here over then here. Covid you know yeah, nothing and then and we found Ruben I found Ruben mm. online too on Facebook yeah. <laughs> <laughs> on Facebook yeah. Yeah. yeah I was looking for a musician Nottingham musician yeah it's just yeah. put an ad out and I was like yeah. oh yeah I want to do that that sounds, sounds great good. yeah yeah <laughs> how, did you very lucky. how did you describe it I've been very lucky right because when I First time I heard him on a rehearsal room, I said, "This is the guitarist I need." Ah. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, um, she also had older versions of the songs as well, so there's also like source material. I could see what she was going for, right? So you could. And I knew that she would probably be up for working yeah. it into new things, yeah. which we've been doing over the past year and a half. But um, yeah, I, I could see that. I Get could hear it. I could hear it. Yeah, like, yeah, there was something yeah. in Where it. Where you could so, fit into yeah. it, because you obviously got quite a diverse sound that you produce from your yeah i try to yeah. yeah yeah try and get as wild as i can <laughs> <laughs> but you're dancing as well it's yeah cool. well that's th sort of automatic i ain't got yeah, a choice yeah. of that <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so for us from a sort of songwriter's perspective who how do, how do songs come about the these songs are about you know uh, normal life what happened every day political situation uh your mood and you're depressed most of the time i write song when i'm depressed Oh, right, okay. And I'm depressed most of the time. So. <laughs> <laughs> Since she met me. Oh, mate, she's, you really, she's yeah. got so many bangers now, she's met him. <laughs> <laughs> Not really depressed. I mean, yeah. but, you know, just pissed off, you know, sometimes. You get yeah, yeah. Something to say. And just, yeah. There's nothing good in the news, is there? Everything's all bad news. Yeah. It does time, seem to be so constantly yeah, bleak, yeah. doesn't it? One thing, by the time, why, well, as soon as one thing ends, it's something else. Yeah, mm. absolutely. Many times I ask me why I'm so angry. I, you know why? <laughs> just look around. Just look around. <laughs> just, yeah. so no, I see. I guess in a way that uh, that so sort of marries response. up your music with yeah. what John Paul does to Yeah, pretty much. But those, yeah. but those like great strong feelings, whatever they are, whatever sort mm. of whatever end they are, if they're happy or sad or whatever, that's where the art comes from, isn't it? Yeah, it comes from extreme emotion, extreme feeling, extreme trauma, whatever it is. You know, yeah. that's that, it. you channel that into something great, and it becomes more resonant. You know. Yeah, absolutely, and really more real. And also, I guess you guys have got a high energy band anyway, so yeah. it's uh, it's got that um, bit of grit to the whole thing. Yes, yes, we yeah, keeps it all together, doesn't it? That's, so yeah. instrumentally, um, do do you come up with the the main kind of ideas for the arrangements, or no? This, uh... The songs are already recorded in oh, the right, album okay. that I did with the previous band. Ah, right. Uh, okay. But I changed completely. The album doesn't exist anymore. It was only online and it disappeared. But so we did all over again, all the arrangement, I changed the part, yeah. But usually I, I'm writing the song with the piano, uh, basic, and then I, I already think about the arrangement, what the drums could do, what, and I already have the idea of the arrangement, and then we do it together, you know. So mm. oh, I see, you just sort of assemble it. And, yeah. and we keep changing, but keep changing yeah. But it's also, you know, like, just the way that someone might play the thing that Eric's hears in our head might be different and that takes it to a different realm and all of a sudden mm. we're playing it completely different to where we started. Yeah, It sure. can just kind of kick off and take a new form. You're like. saying that you've had these songs for the ones we're hearing tonight for a while now? Yeah, 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 they're old songs. That's why I've been working on them for a long time, you yeah? know. They're mature now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so they've been in various forms from the different musicians that's played them and the different moods that they started in acoustic and electric, yeah. oh, okay. electro, mm -hmm. metal, every kind yeah, of been version. <laughs> been through the mill. Yeah, absolutely, <laughs> yeah, really. brilliant. Mm -hmm. yeah. And so you recorded uh, an EP, was that last year? Yeah, yeah. that's right. Yes, it was, yeah. yeah. Live yeah. 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 made, made of ale. Yeah. yeah, BBC Studio. Yeah, it was the, oh, John, nice. the one with the John Peel sessions were, were done in basically. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Thanks very, to him. Thanks to him. Yeah. Well, the weird, the, the, <laughs> the funny thing is, is that um, I think you contacted me uh, through a musicians networking website. Yeah, well, I think. yeah, totally. And that same day, I think I got uh, that initial message. I was having a drink in London with my friend who works for the BBC. Oh, so okay. and he and sort of mentioned this. He was like, I wasn't really doing anything at the time musically. Um, yeah, it was just kind of weird bit of serendipity or whatever you want right. to call it. Yeah, yeah. You know, but yeah, it was an amazing well. day, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, it was. An incredible. Oh, really experience. cool. Really yeah. cool. Yeah. Yeah. Such a historical, synonymous place yeah. with yeah. music and bands and everything. Wow. Yeah. So tonight we're playing four of the songs that were on that, but 
uh, I mean, the, yeah, yeah. They, I mean, I think we we recorded them that day, and literally within a few weeks, we were already ex making them sound bigger and better, and working on them even more. So you're hearing a much more, yeah, a much more. Uh, I don't know what you want to call it. Fuller. Yeah. Yeah. Elaborate. Sort of whatever know. version. More, more, more better. Yeah, better. More better. <laughs> better yeah. yeah. I think they're more playful. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. They were quite, went quite simple with it and tried to keep it tight and simple. Yeah. yeah. And then the more you go play them live, you're more like, oh, you find the bits, and you're like, what well, I want, you want that in there now, mm. you know? Yeah. Sure. And you're tracking an album at the moment. We are. At JT Saw in Nottingham. <laughs> oh right, nice. It's a great studio. Yeah, and are, the, <coughs> are these songs sort of getting another look out, look in uh, from there? Yes, they are actually. The guy Phil, who we're working with, he's sort of helping as he, you know, he's, if he. We he, changed already. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Other versions we hear tonight could be the yeah. same as the versions. We don't know. So a couple, yeah. couple of them we haven't done yet. A few of them we have. So right, okay. We're hoping to like figure out how to play them tonight. <laughs> awesome, but it's a good opportunity. <laughs> Usually the drums takes a big hit in the studio. Yeah. Into, uh, no, just change that. Just change that. All right, start again. <laughs> but he was very meticulous on recording drums, though. Yeah, yeah. He, his his the way he worked was really collaborative. Yeah, it was very nice. Yeah. He was just throwing out like ideas, and he's obviously a very musical chap. You know, mm. yeah. He's really into that. what we did as well. Yeah. Oh, cool. So there was re some really good suggestions yeah. that he was, yeah. you know, throwing at us and kept us on our toes, didn't it? Really. He did. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but he did it in such a way that you didn't feel, you know, pressure, no, no, pressure, pressure right. by him. Yeah, they were just right. sort of like, you know, try yeah. this, have yeah. a go at that. And he make a joke of it, of how bad you did it. And then, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now try it properly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Do it again, but better. Yeah. <laughs> That's weird, yeah, cool. So from a guitar perspective, obviously you've brought you've brought this mighty pedal board with you today. You've mm -hmm. done all you do sort of a combination of nice crunchy work and some uh, like ambient sounds and uh, soundscaping and that sort of thing. Yeah. Tell us a bit about your uh, your guitar playing, your inspiration for all that. I mean, it's it's really varied. I think I think musically, I do listen to a lot of a lot of stuff. Um, I guess in terms of channeling that into pedals and trying to get mad sounds, obviously mm. very in influenced by idols and a lot of the sort of modern bands, the way they do that. Um, but like I love, I love Billy Holiday as well, and people like that. So there's like a, a sensitivity that you get from listening to those artists and sort of taking sure, them into your yeah, heart. Absolutely. All of it kind of comes out into the guitar, and then, but then with styles of music like that, if it's a bit jazzy and things like that, I'm not a great jazz player, but I like it. Mm. Um, they'll come into the music, but you can't put them in too strongly because it's not about we're not doing that sort of thing. Yeah, you know, it yeah. has to be like kind of. <laughs> straightforward and simple it, yeah. and if it can be a little bit interesting complex at times great but don't take away from the song yeah it's, the, it's the plan really yeah. to put as much as i'm allowed in and Eric, <laughs> yeah. eric's yeah. will tell me if yeah. it's too yeah, much sure. like it's cool <laughs> like <laughs> if the guitar player goes off on one yeah, yeah. Sometimes, Eric's the thought that, that would happen. sometimes he comes out with great things uh, he didn't notice said, Ruben, this is great you have to keep that yeah. keep that and keep that and drop this one and that I put all together, all the best, mm. and it's, it's good. <laughs> yeah. You go into a zone, don't you? And it's just yeah, like, and that's the problem. I can't always remember what's what happened. No, I'm like, <laughs> yeah, what do so you mean? Like, if only we'd recorded it. That's yeah, what we exactly. With the phone all the time. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, I'm jealous of your pedal board as a fellow guitar player. It's, <laughs> it's very expansive. I'm very it is. <laughs> it's a bit DIY at the moment, though. I could I could refine the, the system a bit. I think <laughs> it's the, the aesthetic kind of works with the uh, with the band. <laughs> I suppose. Yeah, yeah. It's cool. So. Talk bass for a moment. For what's your uh, so you're anchoring a lot of the, uh, the yeah. sort of harmonic structure of the very much so. I mean, you know, I, I, I take a very mm -hmm. very different approach in this band than what I have done previously with other groups, mainly because I'm told to. <laughs> uh, but, I've been uh, obsessed with, with the yeah, Viagra boys yeah, <laughs> for, yeah. for months. But uh, <laughs> we we worked really hard on getting the tone and the sound of uh, of, of what we what we use. But yeah, very much so. It's the idea is that myself and Colin are very much the anchors, and these two are the guys that do all the Kind of magical, the free form stuff. Mm -hmm. The anchors, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> 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 okay. uh, well, yeah, Sorry, that man. too. Yeah, I'm, getting, I'm getting hippie. <laughs> <from anyway. laughs> yeah, Dig hope that answers your question. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah very nice. And you go for like you've got a drive sound, and then you've very got a more so, melodic yeah. sound as well. Mm. Yeah. We try and lock it in. Though. We do, we do. We try our best. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Trying cool. to get the, that punish in us, like hitting hitting us in the face, and then we can sort of mm. dance mm. with me and Eric's and dance around that. And it becomes an onslaught with a bit of thought. Yeah. No, it's a good, good sentence, nice. wasn't it? Yeah, yeah it's it good. Yeah. It just fucking yeah. came out. 
<laughs> and you guys have got obviously a very locked rhythm section between you. How's that from a drummer's perspective? Uh, no, man, you get tighter and tighter as you go. Well, you we get, yeah, it's yeah. just practicing mm. and um, yep. practicing, adapting to each other, practicing, learning practicing. from each other. And it is just practice, 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 you know, yeah, until sure. you can just, you, you don't need to be told what each other's doing. You just lock into it. You just, you know, straight away before they're even playing it, where they're going, and, you know. That's it. Well, that's where the beating heart of the music yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, pretty the, uh, much. The yeah. Pocket the rhythm section pocket. Mm. But with no drum solos, though. With no drum solos. <laughs> yeah. well. How I prefer it as well. Yeah, I've got a little there is one. one. You've got a little one. We're going to play it in a bit. You got like oh, they... <laughs> yeah, 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 we yeah. cut it in half, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, you did, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, what are, so, what have you guys got going on at the moment? What, uh, what, can, uh, what can our audience at home look forward to from you over the next uh, few months, like in terms of live shows or recordings? Well, the album will be out as soon as we can get it out, obviously. It's a long process you never know how long that's going to take hopefully within the next few months uh we're playing in leeds on the 18th of march yep yeah. at wharf chambers we're playing in york on the 31st of march Paul for arms Paul yeah. for arms yeah great yeah. venue and then we're playing we're doing a little one in grantham actually which is not too far from here on the 7th of may that's a sun yeah. oh, sunday yeah, that's a nice bank bank holiday, holiday. yeah oh is it bank holiday yeah, as well bank holiday cool. weekend. yeah we're doing that and yeah, we're we corby discharge. corby at the end of april as well all building up, as we were saying awesome. earlier, to Rebellion Festival. Yeah, which okay, is the, so the big, the big daddy in August. For yeah. the second August. year. Yeah. yeah. Okay. On the same night as the Damned. Yeah. yeah. Oh, very nice. Yeah. And, <laughs> and Opus Kink. And Opus Kink. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Awesome. That sounds fantastic. Yeah. Well, good luck with it all. But uh, we're here for the music. How do you fancy uh, giving us the rest of your. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, so let's, let's go. For let's fucking have it. Thank you. Just a boy, I'm not to blame for the same word, cause I'm just 
just a boy Just a boy Just a boy Thanks a lot.
crow I feel like snow Story of my life, Parasite. Because I'm sleeping on the through that I'm so poor I wanna be free 
fish warm, but it got so funk You want me to go job, but I don't really give a fuck The life's too short, to stay on the line I'm not a slave, I want on a die A worker in your company, a victim on your robbery I don't wanna die in vain It's a point of your production chain Fucking make it, yeah, like a parasite And so, all too soon, the show must come to a close. Thanks to Eric's London and John Paul for giving us such a memorable hour of music. You can find them on Facebook and Instagram, and stream or purchase their music from Bandcamp, so go check them out. We will be back on Sunday the 16th of April with singer-songwriter Hope Hardy for what promises to be a fantastic set. See you then, and remember, it may take a lot to laugh and a train to cry, but one click gets you an hour of music once a month, live in the basement. Until next time, bye-bye.